Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to look at oil analysis from a fundamental and a technical perspective as well. As you can see the chart, I left all the comments from the previous analysis. We have many fundamental data that has happened during the previous time. What is important for us will be related with this wave on the right corner of the chart. At the beginning of August, we saw the price moving down up to 77.8, but uh, as I explained during the previous analysis, OPEC was not happy with the price and they wanted to cut the oil production and later we saw oil price testing 95. So it was very strange because it happened uh, in a normal situation. It was not uh, normal all of this movement that happened here and when the price reached 95 it was also discussed that probably uh, the US is going to face a recession because of the oil price that was getting very very expensive. However after a, a short meeting that they had we saw the price moving down it was the OPEC meeting uh, that was in uh, the US the price moved down up to 81.47 but in the current conditions everything is uh, a bit difficult for the moment so when the price reached a new low close to 81.47 we had another problem the conflict between israel and hamas that began on october 7th the price increased but as you can see created another new low here that is not normal in the war position so this is getting very strange so far it was OPEC that increased the price up to 95 uh, OPEC meeting pushed the price down again and the war didn't manage to push the price up to 95 this is uh, a type of situation that we have to be very careful the current conflict is not clear uh, yet what is happening or how it may escalate during the coming weeks this was the top that was created with oil and if we are going to look at uh, also in a different perspective the price managed to create a, a new low again so look at where it was at this point that is why we have to be very careful on the other hand during the previous week the price is in this area for uh, about 20 days so far below this small structure zone and it uh, it looks clear uh, that we have a possible range trading opportunity so the, the price has uh, been stuck in, in this area since many days so far this is what I'm looking at. This is a potential movement that it may create. It is not a clear one, but if we are going to move this on a, a smaller time frame, what we can see is that we have a resistance on the upper part. This is a minor resistance and we have also support on the lower part of this area here. This is approximately one week old, all of this pattern. And if we are going to look at this for other details, we may observe also a type of price expansion and this is creating a type of megaphone pattern. We have to be careful, usually the megaphone patterns are, are created in the direction of the trend and it is likely that we may see the price moving down further. However, in the current uh, conditions that it is not clear yet related with the war, I would like to be very careful. And in my opinion, uh, this megaphone pattern that corresponds also to a day trading pattern is adding the chances that it may increase up to the top again. So after any small correction, we may see any pause in the trend direction and the price may test the top of the megaphone. So look at how this pattern created higher highs all the time that the price came close to the top 
of this pattern in this way it may come close to the pattern again and it will be in line also with the bigger picture that is where we have to be very careful so for the moment i think that the price may stop close to 83.5 84 probably this is the area uh, that we are looking at for this megaphone pattern it's a, a 60 minute megaphone pattern so the price should continue to increase up to 84 this is what i'm looking at for the moment however on any deeper correction we may see the price to finish the move also close to this small structure zone close to 82.7 these are the intraday targets that i'm looking at uh, for oil analysis so far the price should continue to increase however even if we see any deeper movement to expand the pattern more it is likely that we may see the price moving back up again if we are going to look at the four hour time frame it is making more sense at this moment as you can see the structure area is very strong so it was tested also during the previous time several times look at the density of the zone that we have here also the structure zone so the price may face a reaction and it can move down this is for the moment what i'm looking at however if the price will manage to break through the current pattern that is also Oh, very weird how it is taking shape because it can do both moves it can move down and it can continue lower or it may break up and it may continue higher so the bullish scenario that probably may happen can be if the price will break through this zone and it will open the door for more upside until that moment uh, in that scenario in the bullish scenario the first zone that i'm looking at for a possible pause in the bullish movement should be close to this structure zone it looks very strong for the moment look at where the price stopped several times look at how it was tested also this area here and we may see price to stop close to 86 again it is also a round number and it makes sense that it can take a small pause on the first target that is this here and probably later it may challenge the top of the structure again so this is overall for the oil analysis on the other side the bearish movement may happen from this point however i would like to be very careful because the current situation is not clear uh, yet related with the war and also with uh, the further steps that opec is already uh, taking during these moments so that's all for oil analysis i hope you guys enjoyed please don't forget to hit the like button and follow thank you bye bye